Hi. Okay. Um, I kind of pretty much was saying in a simpler sense of it um, that I am, I'm still going to post that video and have that video, but that it goes creativity and then creation and created. Um, I'm going off of my head. I'm not really looking at the paper because, well, wouldn't that be more scripted and not really able to flow and just kind of being? Um, but basically, creativity has always been. That's where we live. Um, and then you have creation, which is as mother, father, essence kind of thing, um, which is God. Um, and then you have created, which is an I am. The reason why I say that there's creativity, because we all live in creativity because we're creative. You can create, even though you might not make a piece of art, you still are making a piece of art. It might not be on that paper or that video or that music or whatnot, um, <clears throat> bless me, um, that, <clears throat> bless me, goodness, that, um, you still are creating, um, because both creation and created can create. It's, it's different viewpoints that you see it from, which is creation and created, um, because you can, you are God in a sense of you our co-creator and you control your world and you empower or you bring forth empower me um, to that of your world by creating <coughs> oh, goodness bless me um, that mother father essence creation can only be in that of created through that of an I am. It, I guess it would assist if you understand that um, that of oneness, we are, everything is one, it's all within kind of thing, but that mother father essence is kind of like the push and the urge to bring forth creation, to bring forth created, because um, you have, because it can't, it, not that every not that there's a hierarchy, but there's different levels to things, um, different deepenings to it and whatnot. Even regardless of what way you look at it, there's more there's there's deepening from any perspective that you go from. Um, you gotta go you go from creativity to creation to created. Um, even though all of them are the same, kind of go back to that one this kind of idea. Um, also, it kind of brings forth that of um, oh, creativity holds a space to have that of creation and created through that through that of creation and creativity. Know that of what is creative through that of creativity, being that it's everything separate, but they're all one, considering they all coexist and hold the same energies as in that of that of creation knows creativity from creativity allowing creation to move into itself because creation holds a space it's kind of like you laying on a bed and you have three people being physical you can't go through that person but that there's a male, there's a female, there's a child. That female is able to experience what it is to be a male, even though she's a female, through that of that male being there. Um, like maybe being able to, that male being, not to say that, anything anything of that but just as an example that child okay that's a better one the child being able to jump but the male being 
without male being able to lift something on that bed, okay, lift something, um, that child goes to lift it, they're not going to be able to lift it because it's a 100-pound a, a weight, okay. That female equalness, okay, um, does the same thing. That child won't be able to. But that child experiences that 100-pound weight being lifted through that of the female and the male, regardless if that child is a male or a female. It still experiences that of the weight being lifted through that of another person. That's kind of how creation and creativity experience is created. Kind of how experience, how, kind of how creation and cre created experiences creativity, and vice versa, to create, because they all create, basically. Um, but I had to recall what I was saying because I kind of got a little over here to explain it so that it, you can pretty much bring a follow through so you can understand what I'm talking about without jumping much more of a follow through and convenient for everybody. But um, what I was saying was that um, creation is mother father essence and created is an I am. That they are each other because it is the same thing and they live in the same thing but at the same moment I'm also saying that one of the father essence isn't the top not the top top it might be one version of the top but it's not the top top creativity would be the top if you need a top or if you want a label or something like that something to fixate on to, to understand to shape it around, to bring forth deepening to. Because um, in the sense, you are the top because you create your own world because you are creative. And you, with you being creative, you are creativity, which you can create, which brings forth creation, which brings forth created. But... <laughs> But what I was saying was, what I'm kind of getting at is, um, you know, God, Mother, Father, Essence says, let my will be done. And there are beings out there, people, <laughs> that are saying, um, life forms, are saying that of Mother, Father, Essence is willing, urging, and encouraging that of the I am, the created, to go back to that central point. Somewhat to bring back that knowledge and whatnot. Also to wake up from an illusion, a dream state, because everything that's not loving and perfect and flowing in harmony and all of that isn't really reality. It's more of an illusion kind of thing. It's that's kind of the whole other topic, but basically to go back to that of peace and harmony and all that kind of stuff. In another sense, there isn't hierarchies. There is um, just oneness kind of thing. So everything is equal. Um, that in the lower dimensions, there's ego, which is here. We have ego. That's how we perceive. That's one way of bringing forth more of ourselves and another deepening another aspect of to understand ourselves um with that that ego doesn't exist in the higher realms um because ego can bring for can bring forth and opens a door and holds a key to open that door to um the space of greed and anger and separation and all this kind of stuff because um, it's what we came here to experience is separation to understand 
oneness more in more of a sense because once you once you have something and then you don't have it you can understand what it is not to have it kind of thing um and so what they're saying is we need to put the ego away um and go back to that why would you go back to the old kind of thing i was watching this video and he brought up a very excellent point that we perceive different things and we perceive stuff in different time retrospects um such as another place can experience a day within an hour or experience our day to them would be an would be their hour and in their hour they experience 24 of them still but they experience basically 24 days in that one hour or that they experience 24 days in that one day because every hour is a day from our retrospect so it really it would be like 24 days kind of thing um so they so places experience different time differences and so we understand differently so we would get more out of that day of our day than their day more kind of kind of kind of um in the sense of we would experience more of that more of the energy and the deepness of the energy rotation of the energy up down and around when they can only experience that of the energy of a sideways of just the sides because they have considering every day we have the different energy same as them but their days would be that of a day but it would be 24 days in that one day going back to their hour to our day um so there are beings that are saying put the ego away what i was saying actually was why put something away when you learned it when it's you that's kind of not to say that mother father essence is willing us to stifle ourselves not to really empower that um to bring more empowerment of free will and encouragement and love because that's what it comes from right um that it kind of is going towards that that if you put what you learned away more of yourself and more and whatnot because i could understand that you know how in the greek mythologies that if you like that one movie that where i can't really recall it percent and son or is ha where hades brings forth that kraken and then the other gods are like whoa and hades lives off of fear and the other gods live off of love and that kind of stuff that the other gods start disappearing because they don't have belief anymore because people don't believe in them they believe in fear and hades and stuff like that that's kind of what it comes down to that mother father essence wants that in belief that empowerment because if mother father essence feels so passionately passionately and has created made sure that that's how that gets structured of feeding into that kind of thing not to say that that's wrong or right but to say that you don't need to put your stuff away don't put your ego away just learn from it and use how to learn how to use it um don't throw it away because everything's valuable everything is valuable even throwing something away is valuable how a lesson lesson and stuff like that um another sense of it what i'm saying is that there's there's a balance coming forth that since mother father essence has set it up that way where you have to feed into mother father sense to empower him to keep mother father sense alive kind of thing um because if mother father sense isn't alive nothing will exist which isn't true it's how you create your world it's how you shape your world i don't believe that actually that's kind of why i'm saying this because my belief but and it's my truth there's a difference between truths and opinions um but not to get into that um what i was saying was from that guy that 
that I seen earlier that put in that perspective of um or also encouraged me to put out these videos more um was that or is that <laughs> how you say it um is that of um the people here experiencing things experience something in deep or basically they seen the sides to side and up and down and even inside and outside of it the other peens that haven't been here that in a while or have never been here have only ever experienced the side the side of things more of a you know recent even though it's affinity and keeps going 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 into more affinities but since they haven't been here they haven't they've experienced that day that has 24 days because they have 24 hours every hour of theirs is the day of ours so it's like 24 days for ours and 24 days in their one day so do they grow faster or whatnot that's not even the question it's whatever view you want to go from it but they don't see it as they haven't they allow themselves not to have the opportunity to see inside and out and all around they've only allowing themselves to see side to side or just the outside not the inside um so and they also kind of are existing in that whole not to say it's fear based but it kind of is fear based because you have fear or love you can choose fear or love so you always find enjoyment which is love or you can find hate and dislike which is somewhat of a fear kind of a thing um but basically it's god mother father is supposed to be a love right but the reason why i say it's not bad or wrong because nothing really is bad or wrong it's just different sides that you look at it from that within creating us to be created which we are we are we are creators meaning we don't really destroy things we just create um so we bring deepening and expansion and whatnot or well, some of us some of us don't some of us hold that space of that um which is destroying and stuff like that because there's got to be that balance but there's a balance coming basically um that mother father essence has been at the top is now going to get put at the bottom and the i am's that have been at the bottom kind of thing is going to be put at the top and soon it's going to be put into a balance where they're both side to side always or when the father essence put back the top and then vice versa but i say well i think it's more preferable and i'm going to will it this way that it's going to be put side to side because we all live in within creation kind of thing um i don't know if you've seen that because i was like this and then mother father essence the top and created the bottom and then guess which kind of thing give you balance but um but yeah um that's basically in a more calm down flowable understandable deepened kind of a sense um of what it is i'm also i'm going to post both these videos like i said but um because it's really funny the other videos you're gonna kick out of I know I was laughing at it of course I'm the first person to always laugh at, your, at myself you should always laugh at yourself the first person because if you don't enjoy it then why is anybody else gonna enjoy it and regardless if anybody else enjoys it why don't you enjoy it because you're not going to want to feel angry or fear as a preferable sense you can but what I'm saying is it's more enjoyable to feel love to feel a heart and harmony that's a crystal it's um oh my goodness obsidian yeah the reason why I showed that was because of energy and stuff like that it's, everything's energy but yeah um, I'm gonna let this video um, bring forth a pause
give this video to the next. Um, but yeah, um, so be peace, be love, enjoy, happiness, prosperity, acceptance, abundancy, freedom, free will, self-worth. Um, everything's valuable.